Liver disease can be a big detriment to the body and the treatment options for liver disease are not always the best. There is a question of whether fasting can be an effective technique to heal the liver or at least help limit the damage to the liver. Hi, I'm Dr. Legrand. Welcome to my fasting channel. If you are looking for a channel that talks all about fasting and health tips, fasting science and research, you have come to the right place and should hit the subscribe button to keep it locked here on The Dr. Legrand Show every Tuesday and Thursday at 5 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. In this video, I'm going to talk about how fasting helps reverse and prevent liver disease. I will go over the importance of the function of the liver and why it's important for the human body and our health. I will also go over the research that is provided about fasting for liver disease and how it helps prevent further damage to the liver. The liver is known to play a major role in the body. The primary function of the liver are bile production and excretion, excretion of bilirubin, cholesterol, and hormones, metabolism of fats, proteins, and carbohydrates. It is also includes the storage of glucose, the specific type of sugar that the body burns as it requires energy. Glucose reserves are stored in the liver following the consumption of food and then released into the blood circulating system as needed. This is what normally occurs in the human body. When fasting, things do change. The liver will continue to hold a reserve of glucose for about eight hours. After this time, it will have released all the glucose that was reserved within the organ. This causes a state of gluconeogenesis. This is the point where the body really enters into a state of fasting. Since no carbs are consumed during a fast, fat reserves will become the source of energy. The liver will start processing fat and convert it into an appropriate form for the body to use. One study found that the accumulation of certain compounds is different in men and women. When men fast, triglycerides seem to collect in their liver. The same is not true for the female body, as triglycerides rather tend to accumulate in muscle tissue among women when they are fasting. Liver disease is common in the general population and is larger attributed to by the high prevalence of obesity, an important risk factor for the development of non-alcoholic fatty liver disease. Thus, an important benefit of fasting that should be considered when looking at the prevention and even the treatment of liver disease would be weight loss. A study published in the International Journal of Obesity confirms that the efficiency of weight loss can be greatly enhanced with the use of intermittent energy restriction or intermittent fasting, as it is more commonly known. In a study led by researchers at the Baylor College of Medicine in Texas, Researchers looked at the effects of time-restricted feeding and fasting in general on various health-related factors, including non-alcoholic fatty liver disease, as well as metabolic syndrome. The researchers found that these techniques led to improvements in homeostasis regulation of lipids and glucose. A reset in the hepatic circadian clock was also noted among the researchers. The study provided further evidence that fasting can assist in improving factors such as serum lipid profiles, as well as reduce oxidative stress. Body mass index also improved with the use of fasting techniques. These are all factors that contribute to the development and advancement of liver diseases. Previous studies have confirmed that oxidative stress has a major impact on the development of liver injury, as well as the progression of existing injury that the liver had suffered. When the liver becomes injured, scarring and further damage eventually causes the development of diseases such as non-alcoholic liver disease. Continuous progression then leads to a condition known as psoriasis which leads to a dysfunction of the organ. Reduced oxidative stress induced by fasting can help to limit the damage to the liver. To summarize, the liver is an important organ in our body, which is the primary function for bile production and excretion, excretion of bilirubin, cholesterol, and hormones. 
Metabolism of fats, proteins, and carbohydrates are also processed in the liver. The liver also is responsible for processing glucose through a very important mechanism known as gluconeogenesis. Over time, the liver can be overtaxed and can cause non-fatty liver disease. Fasting has been shown to help reduce oxidative stress, help metabolize lipids and glucose in the liver. In return, this can help prevent and help limit the damage to the liver. Please let me and the community know in the comment section below if you have improved your liver with fasting. Also, don't hesitate to ask any further questions about fasting. Keep it locked here with Dr. Legrand by clicking on the subscribe button right here. For more things about fasting benefits, check out this playlist right here. If you want to know more about autophagy fasting, check out this playlist right here. Thank you for watching, and until next time, this is Dr. Legrand signing out. Bye.